Didn't see you there. Got a sword cane for you today. This one's from Cold Steel. It's what they call the heavy duty sword cane. Um, probably because if you got some serious business, then you're gonna want this thing. Uh, it's basically a full size sword. Um, it's got a full handle to it. As a back edge, it's just a straight blade, really thick spine to it. Take a look at some specs on it, and we're actually going to do some cut testing with it. We've cut tested one before, it was a Hanway carbon fiber sword cane a while back. But today, we're doing the cold steel one. All right, let's get to it. All right, overall length of the sword cane is 32 inches. So you got a rubber tip on there. Swag it out. You can grip this down and everything just like a normal cane would be. It looks super creepy like this, how I'm standing right now. Um, even the better news of is you have a sword cane. It's a full size sword, so I mean, if you're looking at it from here, from like my actual hip bone down, it goes all the way down to my ankle. So putting the actual cane part aside, there's no hand guard, but you actually have a full grip for it. Don't thrust anything hard with this at all because. Yeah, sure, you got a little bit of that. But if you put this into something that doesn't have a lot of give, like something like a Tommy Mat, that thing's gonna run all the way up your hand and you're gonna lose your hand. You're doing this with proper cut testing if you're cutting with it, but you got you, know, you got full full slashes with it and everything. It kind of feels like you're fighting with a really, really sharp umbrella, to be honest with you. But you have like all your thrusting with it and everything. So Sure, improvised weapon, costume weapon, or just to have some fun with it, it's pretty cool. It's got a back edge to it. I will say that it actually does feel really good. The handle feels like a rattan stick, like when we were training Kali, like Filipino martial arts. It just feels like that. I think it's the same material that they use for their uh, polypropylene, because it is a poly handle, so yeah. Back edge is really, really sharp. I mean, look, this is the back edge with it, watch. Look at that. Look how far that went in. And that was just like a lazy like movement with my wrist. Thick spine, it is full tang, it's, it's pinned. Very, very subtle pins there. This is the retention on it, so if you're looking at this side of it, it's just like a, more of like an aluminum tube for this one. I mean, shit, if you even, didn't have that thing and you had this like that's still pretty damn good in comparison yeah high carbon steel is always a cold steel nice and sturdy it is a heavy duty sword cane so I guess if you were to make contact with this with the actual this piece of it it would do that I haven't tested it but they usually have some pretty quality stuff drawing it's kind of wacky um, there really isn't that great of a way to draw it. Because even if you grab the pinky, I'm gonna do it slow. It just weirds me out that that's kind of floating because I don't want my hand to slide up. I don't know how they want you to actually draw it or if they even show you, but if it is to draw it like this, I don't know, man, that kind of that kind of freaks me out to uh, have it back that far. I feel like that's gonna go, go flying, so. If I was to hypothetically say how to draw it, I'd rather draw it halfway and crawl my hand up. Now I actually have security on the weapon and on the grip as I come out. But you're gonna have to figure that out for yourself because this isn't a video on drawing, it's a video on a product. So from here, let's take a look at some close-up looks in the cane and out of the cane. And then we'll do some cut testing with it. Let's get to it. All right, let's take a look at some cut testing and see what this sword cane can do. Let's get to it. Yeah, 
and it's also a straight blade. So if you imagine you got a little bit of an arc to it, you're, you're going all the way through the target on that. This sword cane, very sharp, functional, heavy duty sword cane. Go ahead and like this video, subscribe to the channel. Let me know what other Cold Steel products you'd like to see on the channel. We actually haven't done a whole lot of Cold Steel. Like we did the Black Bear Bowie. Um, that one was pretty cool. You know, so that one cut really well, actually. It was one of my favorite Bowies. So if you like this video, subscribe to the channel, like this video, and I will talk to you soon.